Show you how to lap valves on a Toyota 22R. Make sure that you first clean up the surface of the valve seat with a, a mild wire brush and some brake clean. And make sure that the valve stem, or excuse me, the valve uh, guide is nice and clean. Then get your uh, valve. I prefer to use Japanese valves because Chinese valves are garbage. So once you get the valves out of the package, put some valve grinding compound all over the face of the valve. Then slide it in the hole like that. Should go in nice and smooth. Then take something like this here, which is a piece of rubber hose that I have attached with a little drill bit. So it's pretty short. So you just take that and connect to the end of the hose or end of the valve. Connect the drill to the end of the little piece there that you stuck in the hose and you just start turning it. Get it forward and backwards. It's moderate pressure. The reverse direction. Then you uh, finish doing all the grinding, then you can pull your valve out. And take some brake clean. Spray over the seat. You can see it looks pretty good. And then you want to do the same on your valve too. back of a tailgate on a 4Runner. See, it's got the surface there. It's been, uh, been ground pretty good. You want to make sure that uh, it's even all the way around. And for comparison purposes, this is the surface of a valve that's brand new that has not been ground. See, it's black. This one's been ground. So after you do that, you can take some marking paint like a, a pen here, and then mark underneath the valve which number cylinder that is. In this case, it's cylinder number two. Thanks for watching.